Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Bass from Stoic Gaming. Today we're going to be taking a look at Archage, the character creator. So this is a character that I've been running around. It's my level 6. He's a paladin right now. He used to be an abolisher. But uh, we're going to make a, a, a Haranian character. So we're going to check out exactly what that looks like. So the first, our first choice is we get to pick. Uh, that's not going to work, is it? I guess we're making a new Ian. Because I've already got a new Ian on this server. It's probably going to force me to make a new Ian. Oh no, here we go. Here we go. See, I've never even made a Haranian character. So for Haranian characters, we've got uh, two types. We've got the Farin and the Harani. Uh, I kind of like these cat people. I think they're kind of cool. The Harani just kind of look like Asian humans. Although they got really cool shoes, so that that's always a plus. But we're going to make one of these cool cat people. So uh, Claw to the earth, blood to the water, fang to the wind, fur to the fire. Cool. The restless, nomadic fear and roam the wilds, fueled by dreams of protecting nature and reclaiming their for former glory. They believe every life, no matter how small, is not only valuable but plays a critical role in the natural world, and that every Farron must strive to find their purpose and play their part. Um, he's got some racial abilities, he's got cat-like reflexes. Uh, the Farron's quick reflexes allow them to twist their bodies as they fall and land more nimbly, decreasing fall damage, so minus 20% on fall damage. And uh, strong claws, appearance long, non-retractable claws allow them to climb trees and ladders 30% faster. So cool. Nothing super awesome, but neat nonetheless. So we got obviously male and female. Female has a really weird anime little kid face. Creeps me out. I'm make this dude right here. So let's see what kind of options are. So we got hairstyle here. Are you are you, are you kidding me? Seriously. <laughs> Uh, we'll look at all the hairstyles, but if you've ever seen any of my characters, you'll know all my characters are uh, got the same haircut as me. They're bald. So there you go. Pretty neat hair colors they got, or hair well, normal hair colors. Oh, they got blue. That's kind of different. So we're they don't have a bald. Ain't that some shit? We're gonna go with the guy that can be bald. We're gonna make a Harani today. Ha ha ha. So, here we go. We're gonna go into his appearance, and guess what? He's gonna be bald. Nice. So, we're going into eyes. He's got tons of different, like, eyes. Uh, color selector for the eyes. We always make our guys with some dark blue eyes. That's the eyebrow color, not dark blue eyebrows. That'd be ridiculous, wouldn't it? So we're going to go back over here for eyes, we're going to go into a deep shade of blue. Uh, we want big bushy eyebrows just like these bad boys. Face. Uh, that's weird now. Alright, there we go. We can get some slices on the hair and head. I like that, I dig that. Go back to our blue eyes. Style. No, we don't want any facial hair, no facial hair. Age line intensity, so we can actually make him younger. We'll put him somewhere in the middle. Cause that's me, I'm somewhere in the middle. We can give him war paint. Oh my god. It's like something I'd want to be able to put on. Really? Like his nose is running? No more pain, but we are gonna give him the standard scar going across the eye that we typically give all of our characters. Actually, we can have this scar kind of pseudo lining up over here. Alright, and uh, that's our appearance. 
Now we can change like his nose. Oh, we're selecting his eyes now. Nose. Pick from a bunch of different noses. Mouth. Pick from a whole bunch of different mouths. And head. That's kind of the shape, general shape of his head. So we're going to select a skill set now. So now we've made him, right? So we have one, two, three, four, five, six different um, abilities up here, and you're going to get to pick one of these, and eventually you'll get more, but these are the ones you can start out with. So we've got like a cultism, and it says cultism is symbolized by Nui, uh, goddess of death, and the hereafter, general hands, blah, 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 blah. So it does magic damage, curses, and uh, a little bit of defense there. we got vitalism, it's pretty much a healing tree. Uh, cultism. Uh, that's probably like the, let's see what we got here. Crippling Mire, we got Absorb Life, you can see what it does. That looks like it's kind of like a warlocky type tree. We have Archery, Sorcery, Battle Rage is like swords and stuff. My other guy's a Battle Rage guy. So, Shadow Play, uh, Silent Assassin, or the Assassin, Melisara, known for every blah blah blah. Toxic Shock, we've got. I think I'm gonna go with Shadow Play, and we're gonna name him B A Z Z Z. What you got? So there you go. There's your uh, character creator for Harani. We got a little bit to look at the cat people, and uh, yeah, can't be bald, so screw them. And yeah, that's that. So until next time, this was uh, Bash for Stoic Gaming, and I'll see you when I see you.